This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar exploring the new cut page in DaVinci Resolve 17. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this short video tutorial, I'll show you how to sync, edit, and trim multiple cameras, also called multicam, in the cut page. This footage is courtesy of the two real guys, tworealguys.com, which Norman Holland and I put together many years ago. And I still enjoy working with this footage. This is a multicam shoot. And the cameras do not have matching time code. They're close, but they don't match. The best way to think of this is the cut page is not a multicam editor. The cut page, however, allows you to work with, say, an interview, which is shot with two cameras, and easily cut back and forth and sync the shots without you having to worry about it. And when you're building, say, an interview, again, for multicam, I'd move that to the edit page. But for using multiple cameras, the cut page works really well. Here's how it works. Select the clips that you want to sync, and you click this icon right here, which syncs the clips. By default, it syncs based on time code, but the time code is off. So instead, I want to sync based on audio. Click here and click sync. It now syncs the clips, and if you notice, the slate matches on all the clips. So now we'll save that sync. It becomes a sync clip. You can see the icon there. Let's go to the wide shot, and we'll set an in for the beginning of the scene. We'll set an out for the end of the scene. We'll do Shift F12, and we'll edit the master shot down to the timeline. And we can see the whole master shot. Well, right about here, as Lisa hands the ring to Andrew, I want to drop in a close-up of Lisa. So to do that, I select the clip and go to Sync Bin. This now shows me the sync shots of all three clips. I'm going to find where she takes a breath, right there. Click on camera two. It automatically sets an out five seconds later, which I can trim by looking for her to turn her head right about there and place on top. Notice that I've got this clip. They are in sync, but it's a separate shot. In a multicam, the main camera would change. Here, I'm building a separate shot. Now, I want to get his reaction, so I will click here, get his reaction, and place on top. Keyboard shortcut is F12. Then we're going to get his reaction. We're going to trim it back, grab and trim, get her reaction, play it. So she's talking, and then her close-up, Andrew reacts, and then she turns her head, and the other woman, Danielle, starts talking. Let's get back to the media pool, watch it full screen right about here. So we've got her talking, and then Andrew reacts, and then the other woman talks. The purpose of this is not multicam editing. I really want to stress that. But it's the ability to use multiple cameras that are shooting, say, an interview, where you want to switch from one camera to another to cover a jump cut or to remove some content. This makes that very easy. If I wanted to do full multicam editing and Resolve supports up to 16 cameras in a multicam, then I would switch to the edit page. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar exploring the new cut page in DaVinci Resolve 17. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at larryjordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 325. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's almost 2,000 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers a variety of software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.